Well, by the end of 2029, DTE says its electric grid will be fully automated, improving reliability for customers. Part of that plan includes using smart devices to keep the lights on, especially during severe weather. 7 News Detroit reporter Demetrio Sanders was there as one of these devices was installed in a Detroit neighborhood. And he spoke to DTE about how the technology works and heard from residents about what they think. Over the next few years, DTE is adding thousands of smart devices known as reclosers to their electric grid. And by doing so, leaders with the company say it will improve safety, speed up restoration times and reduce outages. For Detroiters who live near Gleason and Greyfriar Street, over time they've seen their fair share of power outages. Summertime when storms come through. When I was a kid, power outages were pretty, pretty common, honestly. Uh, recently, I'd say not as of much. Tuesday, DTE crews were hard at work in their neighborhood as the company makes its transition to a smart grid. DTE is committed to reduce outages by 30% and cut outage minutes in half by the end of 2029. DTE installed its latest recloser in the area, a smart device that can detect and de-energize downed wires, isolate outages and reroute power to keep people's lights on while crews make repairs and enhance restoration times. These devices can pinpoint the exact location of damage during an outage so we can send our field crews directly there and speed up restoration efforts. The devices can be remotely operated from DTE's control center. So far about 600 have been installed across their service area and more are coming online. In this year alone we're going to more than double that number by installing another 600. Each recloser can benefit a few hundred to more than a thousand customers on a circuit and DTE has already seen how they're beneficial. Just last year alone, these devices helped us avoid 10,000 customer outages and 4 million minutes of power interruptions. And just last week, we had an outage over in Detroit where about 500 customers went out of power. These devices were able to operate and reroute power, so we were able to get half the customers back on within minutes. And residents say anything that makes power more reliable, they're for it. I'm actually really happy that they're finally getting on it, looking for ways to make energy more efficient, make it to where we can actually uh, keep our power on. I'm glad that they make an improvement because they could save lives, man. Demetria Sanders, 7 News Detroit.